invite special request um, I'm going to do the health topic today and just a reminder that you can buy my books on Amazon how to ace your Spanish oral Spanish vocabulary for GCSE and even this one which you might like to get for your parents Spanish in a week so they can catch up with you in a kind of extremely fast intensive course right today llevo una vida sana that means I lead llevo Una vida, a life, healthy. So I lead a healthy life. We have to put the adjective after the noun. Llevo una vida sana. They'll ask you in the question, ¿Qué haces para llevar una vida sana? Or they might say, ¿Llevas una vida sana? Or they'll, are, are you living a healthy life? And here are your answers. The two purple ones and the three red ones. The two purple ones are about activities that you do. And the red ones are about eating and drinking. So first of all, you can either say juego, I play, and you've always got to follow it with al, and then tennis, okay? So you've either got juego al, tennis, football, volleyball, any of them, they're all the same in English and Spanish, or you have this alternative structure, suelo jugar al tennis. Now suelo jugar gets you extra points in the oral, and also you, it means I usually play. So anything that's a habit, you can use this structure, suelo with the infinitive. So those are two options there. If it's not a sport that you can win, a game that you can play with a ball, like tennis, football, volleyball, hockey, you're going to be using a different verb. So you're not, if, even if it's the word deporte, sport, you're not going to say I play sport. We don't play sport, we do it. So hago deporte, I do sport, or like with a suelo, like above here, suelo hacer deporte. So you're going to choose one of these with your deporte, okay? Here are some examples of sports. Ciclismo, which is obviously cycling. Natación, which I know you know, means swimming. So make sure that your ball sports are up here and anything else is down here. And make sure you alternate between the verb hago and suelo hacer and juego and suelo jugar, because that will get you extra points. Exactly the same rules here for what you eat, como. What you drink, bebo. What you avoid, evito. Okay, so for example, suelo comer fruta or como verduras. So I usually eat fruit. I eat vegetables. Bebo agua. I drink water. Suelo evitar el chocolate. I usually avoid chocolate. So in each case, you've got a choice between the verb in the I form and suelo with the infinitive. So here are some other things that you might want to avoid. Las drogas e el alcohol, which obviously mean drugs and alcohol. And let's give a reason for that. Porque pueden causar enfermedades graves. I like that rhythm of that little thing there. Enfermedades graves. Okay, so you're going to say, I usually avoid drugs and alcohol because they can cause serious illnesses. I know that sounds a bit odd, but you're getting all your phrases in there. Suelo evitar las drogas. Porque pueden causar enfermedades graves. And all of your, all of these things you're doing, llevo una vida sana, I live a healthy life. Why do you do this? You do it for this reason. Para mantener la forma, to keep fit. Llevo una vida sana, para mantener la forma, and here are all the details of what you do. Adios.